Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, we are gonna do a five below graphic tee haul. So I probably picked up some of my favorite shirts that I've ever gotten from there. I probably got like five or so shirts. And I will say that most of them, maybe just one, they are all characters from shows or movies or whatever. If you want to see what I got, then keep on watching. So my mom had picked this up for me and I'm going to include it because this shirt was the whole reason that I wanted to go to Five Below after seeing this shirt that she got me. And I hadn't seen any of these online. And she got me this Moana t-shirt. And if you guys know me, I absolutely love her. And I'm so excited because Moana 2 comes out next month. So you best believe I will be wearing this to the movie theater to see it. And yeah, I was like, this is pretty decent quality for $5.55. So this was the first shirt and let's try it on. So here's the first shirt. I absolutely love it. My mom got this in a small for me and I am typically a medium, but this definitely runs big. So maybe that's why they ended up at five below because maybe the sizing was off, but I absolutely love this shirt. I think it's so cute. I mean, this style of shirts where it has kind of like the name with a graphic you see a lot that are like on Etsy and a lot of the time they are like $30 and up. I did buy one a couple of years ago for the one character from The Sopranos. This is so cute. Nothing going on on the back. And I don't think any of the shirts have anything on the back, so I won't really probably show you that. But super cute. The only thing that's missing is Pua, her little pig. This is so adorable. And then we're going to get into the ones that I picked up yesterday in store. I did get technically two shirts that aren't characters. So the first one, I thought this was kind of funny. And it just says, maybe I am the drama. No comment. They have tons of new t-shirts. They have, I can't believe, they did the very mindful, very demure on a shirt. Just like that saying. And I have filmed it for a TikTok video and I'm like, I hope that whoever made these t-shirts wrote that person a check for coming up with that saying or like just that slogan. But anyways, I thought this was kind of funny. Here's our next shirt. I love this. I love the color of it more than anything. I'm so happy they put it in like a hot pink shade rather than any other color. So I think this is super cute and I will probably wear it tomorrow or the next day. I got this shirt. It just reminded me so much of like Y2K, okay, the early 2000s. You would see, and I know they still have these types of shirts around, but I definitely feel like this was what you would see all the time going on vacation, like at the boardwalk or wherever that they would do like airbrush items, you know, t-shirts, hats and everything. And I will say I definitely had a couple growing up. I remember in particular there was one that had my name and like a dolphin or something. But yeah, I just loved this type of style of shirt and I don't have one anymore. Here's our next shirt. I think I also love this shirt as well because of the cherries. I probably like the cherries more than Sweetie. I don't really care for that type of name, but I still love the look of this. It's super comfortable. That's one thing that I do love about their shirts is that they typically are very comfy. All the shirts I got are in mediums besides the Moana one. Also going back to characters, I was so excited for this one too because growing up, Hannah Montana was my girl. I was so excited when I saw this because Five Below, I do have it, but it's kind of worn out looking. I think it was just the style of the shirt and the design. They did come out with the Hannah Montana shirt maybe like a couple months ago or last year. This is the other one that I have, but as you can see, it just doesn't look, it looks like very worn out, but this was kind of the style of it. Like when I got it, I probably only wore this shirt twice. So I was so happy when I saw they had another Hannah Montana shirt because I don't know, it just brings back so many memories of being young and yeah, I just absolutely adored her. And I still love Miley. I still love Hannah. Get the limo out front. And then I didn't see on the bottom, it says part-time pop star. Yeah, I don't, I never questioned that. But I'd be like, what do you do in the rest of your time, Hannah? Honestly, I love all the shirts I got. So I, I hate to keep saying that. But I do like, obviously, the colorway, how basically they matched everything together, being purple. And obviously, her logo was the yellow and the purple. So... Honestly, it matches her hair too, which is kind of funny. Three more to go. Next, we have this Bratz one. I feel like I've seen this shirt or something similar being sold possibly at Box Lunch or Hot Topic. And if you shopped at either one of those stores, and I think they're owned by the same company, and you know, t-shirts there start at like $20. But I'm happy that I never bought 
one of these shirts from there because I saved myself a lot of money. So it just says, in your dreams. And I just love the colorway of this one as well. I love that it has all the girls. Yasmin is my girl. Yeah, I just thought it was very cute. Here's our next shirt. Love this one as well. Five below. I mean, I've done plenty of videos sharing graphic tees from them over the years. I, like, I don't know why I'm acting surprised, but I feel like this is probably my favorite haul that I've done. Obviously, my next person here is not a surprise. You know, if I would have left Five Below without getting a shirt of him, it probably would have been a surprise. So we have Stitch, and he's kind of like cartoonish. And this shirt is a little bit more of like a charcoal -y gray. It's not full on black. But I had never seen this one before, and I thought it was kind of different. And I just like the overall look. I like that we have a different graphic of Stitch, because I feel like a lot of the time with shirts, there are, like, a couple of pictures of him that just get overused, <laughs> essentially. So I've never actually seen this style, like, almost a cartoon type of version of him on a shirt, at least at Five Below. So I thought this was fun. It was different than what we normally see. Okay, here is our next shirt. Now, I do like the color of this one just because I have a pair of shorts that I think would go perfect with this because it's the same type of color in the sense that it's like, I want to say off black, like charcoal again. Yeah, I like this one as well. I don't really have much to say about it. I love Stitch. Okay, and then lastly, we have another one of my favorite princesses, which is Jasmine. Now, I think this is the first time I've actually ever gotten a shirt of her. I also think that's the first Moana shirt, surprisingly, that I've ever gotten. So this one just says, do I have to call the guards? And I just think she's so beautiful, and I just love her so much. Now, with this one, I did get a medium. And the Moana one, my mom had got me a small, and I'm looking at it now. Maybe I should have gotten a small, because it's also the same, like, Disney princess line and everything. But we'll see how this one fits. Even if it's a little oversized, I'll make it work. I've been loving oversized shirts anyways, so we'll be good. Okay, then here is our last shirt. I am happy I went with the medium. There is obviously some space, but I do think a small would have been a little bit more form-fitting. So I'm going to keep this one because I don't think I have that much space that it looks terrible. I think compared to a lot of the shirts, they, it looks the same. So I am super happy with this haul. I don't know if they have any of these online yet. Here's a video that I had actually filmed in store because I was trying to film for TikTok. I hadn't even seen that Deadpool one. Not that I would have gotten it, but that's also, I believe, a relatively new shirt. But yeah, there was tons of new ones and I don't know. I'm sure they'll put them online soon. I will keep an eye out and I will link them below if they do become available. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I will see you guys next time. Bye.